Good afternoon, this is Ron Culbert filling in for Dorothy Simons, filling in for Jim Lakey. Uh, I'm back behind the desk again today, apparently they're all busy. It looks like we've had a return of something that really, really, really looks like winter approaching. So, uh, I can't blame anybody for not doing something. Uh, the weather today, you know, oh by the way it is Monday, and we are broadcasting on Channel 3 and we broadcast on sandylandcenter.org. Uh, I encourage you to go to the Sandy Land Center website because the video quality is better. Uh, what we broadcast here doesn't get, it gets downgraded on the process. Today's the 28th, it's Monday, if you hadn't noticed yet. It's about 56 degrees here in the square at noontime and it's eh, kind of trying to be partly cloudy. Uh, we're looking at a high today of 69 and a low tonight of 59. So it's going to be warmer tonight than it is at noon today. We got a little bit of wind about 16 miles an hour out of the south-southeast. Tomorrow we have 50, uh, 72 for a high and 54 for a low. Some isolated thunderstorms, uh, about a 30% chance of rain here. Wednesday, the high will be 67, low 41, and we have a really good chance of getting some rain on Wednesday. Then Thursday, well, it's Halloween and time for trick-or-treaters. Uh, it'll be 68 for a high, 39 for a low, and partly cloudy. Uh, you trick-or-treaters, be sure and be safe and watch where you're going. We want everybody to have a wonderful Halloween. We only have one birthday to announce today, that's Helen Holman, and uh, we wish her a wonderful happy birthday, and no more until somebody else has to do the news. Uh, for my favorite parts of the stuff, and that's pretty much all I've got for you today, is some meals. Let's see. Oh, over in uh, Maxville, I believe, yes, in Maxville. Today they're having sloppy joe, peas, confetti, cottage cheese. I'm not quite sure what that is. Uh, bun and tropical fruit. Tomorrow, turkey divan, mashed potatoes, and ginger carrots. They're getting awful strange with some of these names. I thought a divan was like a couch. Uh, Wednesday, ah, back to normal. Beef stew or ham and beans. Stewed tomatoes. Here at the Sunflower Senior Center in St. John, Today, it looks like it's grilled steak with mushrooms, buttered potatoes, and breaded tomatoes. Tomorrow, roast beef with gravy, creamy mashed potatoes, parsley, and buttered carrots. And on Wednesday, baked pollock with tartar sauce, baked potato, and Japanese mixed vegetables. We do have one announcement that I could find, and mostly because I'm lazy, I didn't go much chasing. But, uh, Want to mention the Maxville Christian Church Soup Supper and Bazaar, November the 6th, from 5 o'clock until whenever. Free will donation, chili and vegetable soup, chicken noodle soup, homemade pie, and a $100 meat bundle raffle. One ticket for a dollar, six for five. And you can see the ad for that on the station or on the bulletin board on the website. Uh, last week, the chief of police had a, uh, a public meeting and wanted to address a lot of the issues that he's been having to deal with. And I know he's been having public meetings over at the library. Uh, the one on uh, last week was uh, dealing with a number of real interesting issues, not least of which is the uh, fourth officer for the police department. Uh, we were able to go ahead and record that for you, and we will be re uh, broadcasting that tonight after the uh, 7.30 news. And, and I would encourage all of our viewers to watch that, and then to go to the city council meeting and voice their opinion on what, how, what they feel, and, and let's let the citizens be heard, because it, it needs to be done. The citizens need to tell our city council what, what they think, whether they think it's fair to have these guys worked half to death and us not be safe, or whether it's okay for them to hire somebody and let's be right about it. Uh, 
the editorial part of that was from me, not the Shepherd Center, but the Shepherd Center recorded it, and we will be broadcasting it tonight at 7.30, and we encourage all the citizens to come out to the City Council meeting tomorrow night, and, or I mean uh, next Tuesday night, and, uh, and let your councilman know how you feel about it, or you know who your council people are. Stop them in the street if you need to. It's their job to represent us, and let's let it, make them do it. Uh, you know, it's their job to represent us. They raised their hand and swore an oath and said they would. Now let's hold them to it. This is Ron Culbert. Uh, today's thought for the day, I turned to this earlier and I kind of like it. It says here, Dear God, help me get up. I can fall down by myself. This is Ron Culbert, hoping you have a great day.